Okay, everyone, welcome back to part two of the pizza topping tier list. How did it go with Michelle? Let's just say I have no use of my ass at the moment. Ha, get wrecked! In other news, we have a few viewers watching us now. No way they actually clicked on that shitty video. Oh, um, hi there. My name is Joe. I'm a bit nervous since this is my first time in the spotlight. Joe, you are literally the fucking president of the United States. Oh, yeah. Apparently, there are some corn lovers in the audience. There's no fucking way. Good news for the corn lovers. Little Caesars just came out with a corn pizza with a corn cob crust. All I can say is the people have spoken. Wow, that corn cob pizza looks yummy. This has got to be a fucking prank. Anyway, we just wanted to thank you all for your support of our channel. It means a lot. Okay. Let's move on to the rest of these toppings. I am seeing some more conventional toppings here. First is Italian sausage. That shit is goaded in my book. Finally, something that isn't fake news. All meat is S tier, baby. It's meat-tastic. I once had dinner with an Italian man that offered me his Italian sausage. I must say it was a pleasant experience. Just please don't say you stuck this one up your ass. I plead the fifth. I don't think I have been to a pizza place where they didn't offer Italian sausage on their pizzas. The spices on them are phenomenal. Straight to S tier. Oh boy, jalapeno, this is a tough one. Provides a good flavor, but do I really want a snot all over my pizza? Yes, you do, Barack. There is nothing more manly than devouring a plate of those things and pretending they're not as spicy as hell's ass. As a 36-year-old kid, my mother would punish me for calling her a butt muncher by making me eat jalapeno straight from her garden. I would cry for hours drinking bull milk to get the pain to subside. Bulls don't make fucking milk, Joe. I thought it tasted a bit sour. All right, I think we can compromise with B tier for this one. Now we have onions. If you can handle the aftertaste and ass kicking breath, I think this one is a pretty solid topping. Another fucking vegetable. When I run for president next term, I am banning this shit. Shut the fuck up, Donald. You need a balance of flavors, and that's what onions do. There's a reason why the people voted for me. The people want onions. We will see about that one sleepy Joe. I will censor all the comments from those losers that eat that rabbit food. Shut your ass, Don. You don't need to bring our viewers into this and disrespect them. That's a dick move. All right, all right, sheesh. Now say you're sorry, Donald. Fuck off. I'm going to go ahead and also put this in B tier. Not my first choice, but I definitely wouldn't turn it down by any means. Okay, pepperoni. Perhaps something we can all agree on here. Sometimes when I take my shirt off and look in the mirror, I think my nipples look like pepperonis. Don't you guys agree? Joe, your nipples look like fucking milk duds. Why the hell are they so dark and swollen? The kids at school would give me purple nurples during lunch. I thought it tickled, so I let them keep doing it. I'm just gonna pretend I didn't hear any of that shit. I'm with you, Don. Let's just put this shit in S tier already. Certainly belongs there, especially when they're baked crispy. Now we have pineapple, certainly a controversial one. There's nothing controversial about this one, Barack. Why would anyone want hot and soggy fruit on their pizza? I see your point, but the Hawaiian pizza is such a staple among the variety of pizza topping combos. I agree with you, Barack. Ham and pineapple are a great combo. The balance of umami and sweet can send anyone into ecstasy. Just about anything will send you into ecstasy, Joe. This is one that I would love to hear from our viewers. I will admit that at first it sounded disgusting, but it really grew on me over time. I think it belongs in A tier. Now we have extra cheese. Not much to discuss here. Barack quit wasting our time and put that shit in S tier. Cheese pizza is the most juvenile food. I agree with my buddy Donald here. Say no more, fellas. Now we have black olives. That shit is fucking gross. Tastes like ass dipped in paint. I like putting whole olives on my fingertips and pretending that they're eyeballs, just like the chosen one from Kung Pao Enter the Fist. Great movie. But I agree with what Don is saying. Although they taste a lot better when they are baked on a pizza, and that's the topic here. I think C tier is suitable for them. Last is mushrooms. Oh, I love mushrooms. During my hippie arc, we would eat those things all the time and it would give us superpowers. S tier. That explains a whole lot, Sleepy Joe. I think I would vomit profusely if you put that shit on my pizza. They deserve to stay in the dirt or in Joe's diaper because they taste like shit. Sad ending to this one, but I agree, Donald. D tier it is. All right, boys, what do you say we all meet at my place and try out that little Caesars corn cob pizza while we wreck some kids on Minecraft Hypixel? That sounds like a great idea, Barack. I'll bring my homemade mayo. I'll not be eating that shit. I'm bringing extra large meat lovers with extra meat and not sharing with either of you. Suit yourself, Donnie. See you both in a few. See you fellas soon. See you nerds later.